10 years in Dubai. How has Dubai treated you? Dubai has treated me very well. They've accepted me the way I am for being this Malayali girl who moved to Hindi radio station and people have been very, very accepting, very warm. And this city has changed so much. Yes. I mean, it's incredible in terms of just making me comfortable, right? Do you ever feel like going back to your own country? I think about it, Mm. but I'm just like, man, I can't adjust to a few inconveniences Mm. that happens in your own home country. Yes. I feel like Dubai is something else. Like, you know, there is a hustle Mm. for money. You can make, you can be a millionaire (laughs) overnight. You can be a sensation overnight. Yeah. You can do anything. Yes. Like you can earn so much and have a good life. You can you know, you don't have to work as much and have a good life. There's there's all yeah. kind of spectrum out there. And Dubai is also is like the city of luxury. It is. But there's so much more to it right now. There's a it? lot to it. We were just yes. talking about it. You know, Dubai is generally portrayed as, you know, the city of luxury and comfort. And, and golden and Lamborghinis. Beautiful, <laughs> you know, locations and hotels. But there is a Dubai, which is true. Yes. But there is another way of looking at the city as well. I think in the past few days, thanks to social media, I feel like there are so many creators, a yes. lot of creativity that happens here that kind of gets camouflaged in that whole, yeah. you know, portrayal of what the city looks like, the glitz yes. and the glamour. Apart from that, there's a lot more to it, which I'm blessed to be a part of sometimes, yes. blessed to see that on social media. And I go like, hey, it's nice to meet interesting people, which I didn't know existed. 